it's okay for my kids to watch me die slow. But if you had a mesh that had an issue and a bulge against your stomach and you couldn't do what you needed to do, you wouldn't sit down and just wait. Or you... How the hell am I going to lose weight if I have a bulge that's preventing me from moving? Or do you know not know about hernia meshes that are not right? Or do you not know about meshes at all? No, you don't even know your, the, the, the thing you're talking about, but you're talking about it. If you don't know nothing about hernia meshes, and if they're put in badly, or if you're having bad experience from it, you're giving me experience with somebody who don't even know about meshes. Because if you did, you would know I'm in immense pain. The bulge has put a bulge on top of my stomach. The fucking incision hurts. And you talking about calling my therapist because I'm fed up? Maybe I want to live. No, you're not. Maybe I want to live. You're, y'all preventing me from living. This mesh on my stomach permits me from moving. Some days I can't even get up because the shit is so painful. And then you got Dr. Iho Problem Arego telling me that the mesh don't migrate. Honey, stop it. That ain't what the FDA told me or the hernia mesh lawyers or any other person I seen. You tell me get a second opinion. I got five other opinions. How many more GI, how many more surgeries I got to see? That's not tell me that I work on nobody else's work. And the I heard going to tell me I, 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 I've been dying since 2017. All right, we're going to go viral then. I'm going to put this on every fucking platform because Nancy trying to kill me with iHor. And it's not happening. TikTok, say hello to Nancy.